Hey everybody, welcome back to the Ostrogoths campaign. It is Total War Attila. My name is Ben Pope. Uh, I don't, I'm not sure what episode number it is. I don't really keep track. I just kind of record them. I've seen some people out there that have made like 60 something episodes of a uh, campaign in Attila already. And that's just insane. Because, you know, I'm pretty much under 10. And obviously I've, I've been really busy, but uh, kind of shows you the difference. Uh, last episode we had a fight here at Solona. Uh, we had a theoretic victory. As you can see there we lost, I don't know, 1,122 out of our 2,100. It was just, it was just, just stupid. it was just stupid. I don't actually know what happened. Uh, go back and watch it. It was like the walls are down, we're going in, but uh, people just kept dying. So... Uh, we're gonna have to repair this uh, vineyard building next turn. Hopefully, we can do that. We'll have the money, and we're making more money now. Uh, and I have to keep an eye on on sanitation. I see that's that's in the red there, and I think the earlier we do that, the better. Um, it's probably no use for me to have a Latin chapel here, so I think I'll probably demolish that and um, although it's giving me public order it's taking ma maintenance uh, as you can see public order is is fine here uh, I don't even know oh here it is we're getting plus 16 so that's fine actually I'm gonna just go ahead and, and uh, mark for dismantling um, and the reason I'm not liking I'm not, I don't really want Latin Christianity to go up much higher than mine uh, and that's it's not really gonna affect me a whole lot just because I'm Aryan Christian but I'm not really getting much use of the building because I don't need that public order so we're gonna dis dismantle that and make like a well or something that gives us uh, some sanitation to not have a risk of disease outbreak it's the same story for Thessalonica um, uh, here I, I don't know which one I want to get rid of. I need the fishing yetis or jetties. The rally field is nice, I guess. Uh, let's see what he can recruit. Those guys in cohorts. Um, I, you know, well, it's either that or getting rid of the public forum. The public forum gives me some wealth. So let's get rid of this. I can't convert it over anyway. It costs um, 1500. And I don't think I need it here. I'm not in like super danger from anything. Uh, and here, sanitation is not good either, but I I don't have anything to convert over. I want the vineyard for the money. I don't think it's... We can't trade it because our territory is not connected. Um, and I want you guys to comment and let me know what I should do as, as far as expanding. Uh, right now it's either save up money to get desolate, some of the desolate land, uh, attack my allies which are next to me, those guys and those guys. Uh, and Macedonia is super friendly with uh, the Visigoths, as you see here, they're... Oh, they don't have any... <gasps> Ew. Well, I might turn on the Macedons, the Macedonians. Okay, I thought they... Hmm, I thought they were... Mm, well, I guess they are friendly with them, but I thought they were... Um, they're not even friendly. I, I don't know. I'm remembering this wrong, but I thought 
they were allies with the Visigoths, which would have given them a big chance to have the Visigoths turn against me. So, okay, uh, I think I answered my own question. I can trade with the Lugans. Oh, they took Dacia. What? That's my land. Well, let's see if they would trade. The gods will have me listen to you, but do not pass the day in words without merit. No. So, yeah, that's interesting. They would get more money than I would because they're because the lead. I don't like them taking Dacia though. Well, this is going nowhere, so I'm gonna um, oh, I'm gonna assign a governor. Uh, this guy is an overseer, of industrial buildings, mm. tax rate or defender. I guess I don't really have any industrial buildings there yet, but uh, might as well. Might as well go with that guy. And eventually I'll have industrial buildings in that area. So, it might be smart for me to attack the Macedonians since they're right there and that would get me some nice land and unite my my land a bit also. Um, and then I would just have to get one of the desolate places that's between Sergium and uh, and Scoopy. Also, guys, if you haven't uh, voted for my next playthrough in Total War Attila, go ahead and in my channel. And um, I don't care about those guys. They're going to leave anyway. <laughs> uh, go ahead in my channel. Go to my channel and look at my latest faction vote video. And there's a link there. And please do vote for one of the factions that I listed. Um, I'm looking to start a new campaign. And I would like you guys' help to decide on what to play. Um, so far, and a military investment. Uh, disease outbreak. You know what? I just. I was just talking about this. Um, withholding taxes. Subject Gainus. My lord, as one of your tax collectors, I must report that some citizens have been withholding payment. Engage in faction politics. Okay. Let's see. Uh, we shall take no action at this time, but their behavior has been noted. Send the troops. Uh, um, let us send in some soldiers to take what is rightfully ours. Uh, let us use persuasion to defuse the situation there may be genuine grievances to be heard. Let's do that. All right. Um, our our uh, family tree is doing fine. We can now zoom out since the last patch. That's good to know. Our hmm. We don't have an heir, so we have to decide on who's going to be the heir. We have a legitimate three-year-old son. Um, we have some eight-year-old daughters. Actually, oh, never, never mind that. This guy is the heir. With him heir. So hopefully he makes it to become the next ruler. If not, uh, I'm guessing his uncle, Edrica, who's been a good... Um, A good judge and elder and governor and everything. Alright, let's see what we can do about disease. Are you guys diseased? Should probably take you guys outside. Um Okay, repair cost is only three three hundred and twenty now before uh, it was quite pricier before. 
Uh, we're gonna take our military just outside, and we're gonna encamp them. Um. I don't think... These are Cthulians. Uh, will somebody help me against the Cthulians, please? Let's see... Um, take this guy out. Yep. Great. Let's do it again. Yeah. That's like a that's like a double. Um. Yeah. Uh. Is it? Uh. I doubt they're going to trade again. Anyway, uh, so so yes, these guys are going to just sit here and recoup some of their losses. I don't know when we can... Mm, I don't know when we can go back in here w without getting diseased and that place wasn't anywhere near near my uh okay let's see this will have sanitation it's a greenery <sighs> which is what we have to build and we have to wait until next time Okay, and we can't do anything here, obviously. They won't be able to attack me right away, but they do have a lot of onagers. Um, actually, I was, I was going to have a question for you guys. Is there a way to change your capital? Uh, previous games like Medieval 2. Total War, and even before that, I believe, maybe even Empire Total War had an option that you can change the capital of your um, empire or or country, whatever. Um, because if I could change my capital to like here, then I would instantly get be able to trade with some people, um, or more people. I would I would say. Right now, I just. Just can't. Um, I have an edict. Is there something with? <laughs> is is there something with sanitation? Construction cost and growth. Uh, we can probably do growth. That will help us get to the next unlock the next building. I think that's a good idea. We need three growth. Uh, we're close to one. So. That will help us get the next building unlocked. Of course the Gethurgians. Just have to. You know. Pitch in their. Bitterness. And. Um, and a snarl at our faces. That's what they're doing. All right, let's see what goes on through the turn's end. Uh, at any point you're watching this, please do comment and hit the like button. It really helps a lot. You probably hear me say this all the time and you're tired of it. But you know, it, it it's something I have to do in case the viewers forget um, to, you know, get involved. It, the idea of YouTube is is more social than watching TV where you can just you know TV is just a bunch of dudes that are out there looking pretty and getting paid 
and uh, this is someone just like just like you uh, taking time of time out of their day to uh, try to bring some entertainment all right let's see what happens okay so your loyal servants have brought to your attention that your rivals have been meeting in the shadows they only the only common cause that could bring them together is the hatred secret meetings somebody gained a rank all right, mister. Let's give him wolf. And let's give him food. We can't have enough food. Especially when shortage of food in Pannonia. Because of the siege, obviously. Ready for battle. Uh, gonna have to go up here. Looks like it's attrition time. On the move, lads. You have further orders? Oh no. Not the force march. I don't care how tired you are. Can we force march next to our city and not take attrition? We don't. We can't. Okay, so we're gonna regular, regu regularly march back into our borders, so we can uh, recoup some more forces. I'm not really, I'm not really scared of losing this place. Uh, and if I lose it, uh, you know what? No big deal. I'm hoping my allies will help. Um, here's to. Steps towards helping. <laughs> Gonna get my spy in there and try to do something. Alright, let's build a granary. That's uh, gonna take three turns, but it will help our squalor is eight. I don't really know why squalor is eight. One from there, two from there. So, is it three per turn on their squalor? Because that would make it... Uh, it doesn't say per turn. Have we noticed anywhere saying that this is... I, you know, it wasn't it wasn't that high. So that's all I'm saying. We have two there, and we have one here. Okay. Hidden agent. He's fine. Uh, bad winter. Oh, that that's adding squalor. Mm. All right. Um, kill them anyway. We don't have time for games. Meet them. Let them say what they will do to your face. Let them say what they will to your face. Disrupt the plot. One of your conspirators may still be loyal to you. Um, well... I can take the um, sneaky route to send in somebody and disrupt them. I can be brutal and, and kill them. I can meet them and have them s say what they will to my face. Or I can employ them. I think we call it a meeting. I don't know. I mean, it's kind of a kind of a fifty-fifty. Sending in some spies to see what's going on uh, from a closer view would be also ideal. Um, but it's kind of hard to know which will work and which won't work. Uh, 
I hope you guys are enjoying this playthrough. Um, it's kind of got a lot of ups, ups and downs. I don't think I like playing on the hard difficulty. Here's the thing with, with uh, Total War and, and its difficulties. It doesn't really make the AI any harder. Um, as you can see, I mean, those, those guys are allied to me and they're not even going up there to help. So, is that supposed to be part of the difficulty? I don't think so. That's just annoying. I called action against those guys and it's not happening. Um, it's just... The difficulty is just making the disease spreads. Uh, the cries of the woodlands. Mission failed. I was supposed to assassinate somebody, and he was he was a uh, marine general, an admiral. So you can't take your um, people out. You can't take your spy out to the sea and assassination so rebellion imminent I good to know uh, withholding taxes the villagers agreed to peacefully pay their outstanding taxes from now on educa got some influence so these guys got the disease because they wandered too close to the town who is probably going to rebel uh, See, can we actually do anything to these guys? I can attempt to do something, but he won't even reach. Um, so, this place will rebel because they're retarded. Uh, I can't. I can't do anything about it. We're gonna go over here. Now oh, the winter is out. That's a question. And if those guys attack me this turn, I'll have an army to actually fight back with. And if they don't, then we'll deal with them some other way. And if these guys rebel, I'll just attack the rebellions, the rebels, rebels, rebelots. Sweet. The squalor went away because the winter is gone. Uh, so the Macedonians are... What kind of people are they? Iron... Oh, no, wait. It's these guys. Oh, we need a, an actual... We need a spy that's... Close to see. All right. Um, so we're not making that much money now. Oh no. What can we get? That costs money. Trade docks. This is foods. This is industry. We're gonna need all of them. Um. So, let's just go with the industry one. Is everybody in... He doesn't have enough to become anything. He's just a governor. Right. And turn. Unassigned skill. Where is he a governor? Uh, 
Research trade, okay, that's fine. Cunning, construction, melee defense, in the family. Uh, he's lacking the traditional number of grandparents. Hmm. I could do. I can always do building costs. Uh, integrity, negative, corruption would be nice. Authority, uh, defending. Let's let's go for that. I don't even know where he was. Macedonia. Okay. Do we have a problem with corruption? We do have a corruption problem. It's pretty much eating all our taxes up. So that was good. It's a good choice. I'm glad I made a good choice. I'm interested to see what the Cathurgians will do. It's the th their third turn at my door. They probably have some siege equipment by now that they can. Well, I should have, you know, like onagers up the zoo. Kazoo, kazoo, yin yang, yin yang. Anyway, they have a ton of onagers, but they probably also wanted ladders or something. And of course, they left. What jerks. Oh, sweet. Thank you. Can you kill him off? Yeah. Thanks, man. Those guys are cool. They killed off the rebels from Solona. I like those kids. Don't go too close, you'll get disease. Aww. Because of all the filthy Romans from before, they were there and they were like... Whatever, and... <laughs> yep, they have another thing of disease. Uh, okay, so con con confronted by you, the plot withers on the vine. But their ambitions do not. You must keep an eye on those willing to meet in darkness, for they may do so again. I get more control. I like that. Alright, so... You can be an elder. Uh, you can be a companion. And you guys are already already set. How about you? You're a judge. You're dead. Um. <laughs> uh, there's not much going on in our family tree. I uh, don't even have like a proper. Um, Role play going on. Uh, let's sit and camp here for a bit. Um, this place will probably will probably grow. Well, that's that's not a bad. That's not bad growth. It's growing thirty. So it needs. 21. So in like, a, in like three, four turns we'll have enough to build the sanitation thing. Maybe by then the disease will go away and we can bring our um, army back there to sort of control public order as well. So this is getting a granary. So there you go. I mean without without really thinking about this being a problem it became a problem. Uh, town center. Okay, so it's uh, just wait here. Eighteen hundred to build a town center and to convert it is sixteen. Oh, these are damaged now. Um, if I repair all of these, I can't build. 
the granary. How is the sanitation? Uh, you know what? I'm gonna not repair. Actually, repair that. Oh, no. Not repair that either. Oh, I still don't have enough to build. I don't have enough to build a granary. Alright. Granary is being built. So I'm, I'm fixing the sanitation problem. Uh, and next time I can repair stuff. Uh, diplomacy. Have. Has anyone's. Oh, I don't like you guys being in Daisha. Will you trade? No. They don't like me. Uh, Visigoths. Right. Uh, so, next episode, I think, we're gonna go to one more turn's end, just to see if we can build that, um, or, no. I don't even know why I'm going through another turn's end before. I was gonna say we're ending the episode, uh, but let's go through another t turn's end and see what happens. Um, I'm gonna turn my focus towards the Macedonians. Uh, so I'll start with bringing my spy down there and seeing what they have and where I can hit them. And I might have to build another army just so I can attack them in two spots at once. Uh, I think that will make it easier. Uh, then I won't have to fight like... Oh, never mind. They're bringing friends. Githurgians are back with two forces now. Yay! How awesome is that? Uh, I wish my friends would help. A noble birth. Um. Okay, so... We're gonna call in some favors and... Yeah, I don't wanna really wanna wait. No. I could lose some of my own influence. Uh, control 54, Dominion. Yeah, I have a lot of influence. Office secured. That's another guy. Okay, so... Germanic Spearman. Hmm. I only have... Uh, you know what? We're gonna wait and see what to do. Sadly, I can't help that settlement. And... This is now green. It's an even sanitation thing, so that's good. Um, so we're dealing with this issue and we're gonna fix it or attempt to fix it next time. Our army is shortly in good health here. Alright, so it's gonna be a war with Caturgians one way or another. Um, please do comment, like I said before, hit the like button. And let me know what you think I should do with the attacking forces here and with everything else that I wanted to do. <laughs> so I will wait until next time to hear from you guys and I will see you soon enough. Bye.